Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I will show you how you can integrate Monday.com with Xero. So the first thing that you want to do is just scroll down below to the description and click on the link. When you do it, you will get right here to make.com. Make.com is an amazing company that's going to help you integrate various applications. And one of those applications are Monday.com and Xero. So if you're going to like also any help with your scenario, make.com get perfect customer support. They are going to be really helpful. So under team, you're going to find scenarios. Then you can want to click create new scenario. And here, let's say I'm going to click plus and you can add first Xero or you can add first monday.com. So let's say that you're going to have always um, order in Xero. So I can add Xero here and I can have like create an invoice, update an invoice, get an invoice. So when I'm going to, let's say, create an invoice or watch invoice, triggers when invoice is added or updated. So let's say from Shopify, you're going to have it to Xero. From Xero, you want to have it to monday.com. You're going to watch invoice here. You're going to connect with your account. Then you would add another module, which is going to be monday.com. So we want to have it as uh, let's say items create an item, right? Then you need to connect with your monday.com account. So what you need to do is go to monday.com and bottom left and then click on admin and here under security you're gonna have epi so you're gonna copy the personal epi token and then when you're gonna have it you're gonna have uh what do you want to actually have the item name is let's say it's going to be the invoice id but the more you're gonna have the board here so let's say high cpm review you want to have a group id it's going to be like let's say crm and then you can like which items you want to change then you would add the items right here the columns so item name is going to be always invoice ID and let's say invoice number and first name, last name. So this would be my every single item name. And you can choose from Xero all of these. So first something will happen in Xero and then something will happen in Monday.com. And of course you can have it vice versa. So if you can have any questions guys regarding this, let me down below in the comments. I'm really happy to help you provide some guidance and support. You know how it goes, you know how it is. And yeah, have a great day and goodbye. See ya. Now when you're going to connect it, then on the bottom you can easily save it. Uh, you can schedule the settings and run it. And that's pretty much it. Have a great day and goodbye. See ya.